Elon Musk, the futuristic inventor, pioneer, and stargazing spaceman, has discovered a new field in which to stamp his mark, education. Well, I, th I think that the way that we currently do education is, is, is wrong, and, and we're, we're, when you see something like the Khan Academy and so forth, I think that's probably going in the right direction. I mean, generally you want education to be like as close to a video game as possible, like a good video game. Like, you do not need to tell your kid to play video games. They will play video games on autopilot all day. <laughs> so if you can make it interactive and engaging, uh, then, then you can make education far more compelling and, and far easier to do. Musk has invested a cool $15 million in an innovative project with many other initiatives that aim to empower children all over the world to take complete control of their own education. Elon Musk criticizes the contemporary education system for not teaching students the why behind what students are being taught in schools. He says students must be explained the reasoning for learning a subject before being taught because human brains have evolved to discard irrelevant information. Meaning, if a student doesn't see the importance of the information being presented to them, then they will not internalize it. Musk calls this idea teaching to the problem and not to the tools. That it's important to teach, uh, teach problem solving or teach to the problem, not to the tools. Mm -hmm. So this would be like, let's say um, you're trying to teach people about uh, how engines work or, mm -hmm. you know, you could start by a, tr more, a more traditional approach would be to say, well, we're going to teach you all about screwdrivers and wrenches, and, and you, you're going to have a course on screwdrivers, a course on wrenches, and all these things. And it's, mm. this is a very difficult way to, to do it. A much mm. better way would be like, here's the engine. Now mm. let's take it apart. How are we going to take it apart? Oh, you mm. need a screwdriver. That's what the screwdriver is for. You need a wrench. That's what the wrench is for. Mm -hmm. um, and then a very important thing happens, which is that the relevance of the tools becomes apparent. Elon Musk openly stated that the internet has contributed to the learning process of his children. He revealed this in an interview recently. The Tesla and SpaceX boss said that the internet has an important role in the education of his sons, including online forums, Reddit, and YouTube. He thinks there is still learning in school too, but judging by the time they spend online, it looks like most of their education actually comes from online. Elon Musk, the billionaire founder of Tesla, believes that people don't need the education to learn stuff and that work at his companies does not require a graduate degree. An audience member told Musk at the Satellite 2020 conference in Washington, D.C. that several work postings at his company, SpaceX, require a bachelor's degree and specify that a master's degree is preferred, despite Musk's previous statements that his companies do not require a college degree. Musk replied by claiming that college is pointless since you can learn something for free online. Uh, I, I, don't, I, I, definitely, I, I do agree with Peter's uh, uh, point that um, a university education is often unnecessary. Um, th that's not to say it's unnecessary for, for all people, but um, I, I think you probably learn about as much, or, or, or the vast majority of what you're going to learn there in the first two years, and most of it is from your classmates. Um, because you can always buy the textbooks and just read them. Like, nobody's stopping you from doing that. Or go um, online. Or go online. He believes that the most valuable aspect of college is having fun and demonstrating that you can handle your responsibilities to future employers. He also said that he wants to ensure that his electric car company, Tesla, does not have university qualifications for jobs, which he believes is ridiculous. There's no need even to have a college degree oh, well, okay. at all, uh, or even exactly. high school. The, the, um, I mean, if somebody graduated from a great university, that may, be an that may be an indication that they will be capable of great things, but it's not necessarily the case. He claims that outstanding talent is the most important prerequisite for jobs at his companies, despite the contradiction pointed out earlier. Bill Gates, Steve Jobs, and Larry Ellison are among the smart guys who dropped out of college, according to Musk. He also made a reference to Shakespeare, who was the son of a Glover and only got a basic education. However, it must be stated that in the United States, a college graduate typically earns $30,000 more per year than a high school grad. Even Musk himself holds two bachelor's degrees, having graduated from Queen's University in Kingston, Ontario and the University of Pennsylvania's Wharton School, which is Donald Trump's alma mater. The best initiative so far taken by Elon Musk to revamp the education culture is this truly unique and innovative program, the Global Learning X Prize 
worth $15 million, is an initiative by Elon Musk that challenges teams worldwide to create softwares that allow children to teach themselves simple reading, writing, and arithmetic in 15 months. Um, and so everyone goes through, you know, goes like normally, you know, will go through English, math, uh, science, and so forth from like fifth grade to sixth grade to seventh grade, like it's an assembly line. Uh, but, but people are not objects on an assembly line. That's a ridiculous notion. Um, people learn and are interested in different things at different paces. So you really want to um, disconnect the whole grade level th thing from the, the subjects. Allow people to progress at the fastest pace that they can or are interested in, in each subject. And I think, unfortunately, like a lot of education is very vaudevillian. Um, yeah. you, you've got uh, you know, someone standing up there kind of lecturing at people, uh, and they've done the same lecture 20 years in a row, and they're not very excited about it. <coughs> and that lack of enthusiasm you know, is conveyed to the students. They, they're not very excited about it. They don't know why they're there. Yeah, like, why are we learning this stuff? We don't even yeah. know why. Yeah. Um, in fact, I think a lot of things people learn are probably there's no point in, in learning them. Because um, they, they, they never use them in, in the future. So, in another step to change the way of learning and to create better opportunities for children, Elon Musk started a private school. Even Musk's children are educated at Ad Astra, a private school that he founded. The Ad Astra school is unique and innovative as it does not categorize and restrict children by grade. Children aged 7 to 14 years old are taught to work in groups. Not only that, but the subjects taught in this school are distinct from those taught in other schools. Children learn artificial intelligence, applied science, coding skills, and design many things at Elon Musk's school, one of which is making robots. Sports, foreign languages, and music are not included in the Ad Astra School program. International languages, according to Musk, are no longer appropriate for teaching in schools because real-time translation software is now available. So, this is another initiative by the tech billionaire to enhance learning and empower children with advanced knowledge and skills. In the end, it will be not wrong to say that Elon Musk's keen interest in revitalizing the learning culture and inspiring children with enhanced knowledge and skills is refreshing for a man who aspires to sail among the stars. Thank you for watching this. If you found this video informative, do like and subscribe and let us know in the comments below about your thoughts on this. See you in the next video.